Hey guys, Carrie O'Hara out here in Boise. I hope you're all having a wonderful summer. Summer here is hot, 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 a lot like our market. Uh, we had numbers released yesterday, June 2017 to June 2018. We saw an 18% increase in our home prices. So uh, nothing is changing around here. Still seeing a lot of the same. Today I thought I would answer some of the questions that I get asked all the time from people who are either considering moving to Boise or have already made the decision to move here and now they're on the next step. One thing that people always ask me is when should they visit Boise? I think that you should visit Boise if you're someone that is thinking that summer might be too hot or winter might be too cold. A lot of people who move here have lived in a warm weather climate their whole lives and are a little bit concerned about the winter. If that's you or vice versa and you're concerned about the summer, I would say come in January or July. That's our coldest and our hottest month. In January, you'll probably see an inversion. A lot of people are concerned about what an inversion actually is. So if you came in January, you might get to experience that. And if you came in July, you get to experience what a hot, dry summer is like. Uh, we're in a week of 90s, upper 90s, and that will continue next week and probably for the rest of the month and into August as well. So if that's a concern, I would say come during one of those two months. If you're just here to enjoy Boise in all of its glory, come during the spring or fall. Catch a football game, hang out downtown. Um, those are the best months that we have the market. Should you rent or should you buy? I covered in a previous video, we talked about a bubble and what a bubble is. No, we are not in a bubble here in Boise. And as I just mentioned, we saw that 18% increase from June of 2017 to June of 2018. And that is the same thing that we have seen in the previous years since our market recovered in 2012. So 2012 to 2018, a huge increase in home values during that time. Uh, numbers came out for Ada County, which is where Boise is. And there is not a new construction home under 200,000 that has been recorded as a sale this year. Our prices continue to go up. Um, as far as new construction is concerned, you're going to see about an 18% increase from a resale value to a new construction. So make sure you know what you want there. Um, if you want to have more of a value play, I would go with the resale versus the new construction, but the new construction, um, they tend to have a little bit more of the choices that people are looking for these days. So really depends on what you want to go with there but the new construction prices expect those to continue to rise even more so than the resale as the builders have um, limited land to work with and we're also seeing some tariffs on the lumber coming in and then we have a shortage of subcontractors I know I covered that in another video too so rent you can rent our rental market is extremely high as well hard to get a nice rental um, and they're also locking you in for a year lease in most cases. There are short-term short -term corporate rentals. So if that's something that you're interested in, maybe talk to your agent about that. Steps you should take towards relocating. So say you've decided that Boise is your place. What is the step? What are the steps that you need to take? First, I would say, you know that the market is this hot. You want to make sure that your home in whatever state you're moving from is pending before you come for a house shopping visit. The market in most cases does not allow for you to put an offer in, then go home and say, I'm gonna put my house on the market. No. A lot of these desirable homes are going to get multiple offers in your opening weekend on the market, um, and then you're competing to have the what you can, how you can make your offer the most desirable to those sellers. So you wanna make sure your house is at least pending in that other state. Pending without contingencies is even better. Moving towards closing um, really relieves some of that stress on the seller. Also, the agents here are very familiar with the major markets that people are moving from, so don't worry too much about that. Um, we understand that some of those markets are moving as fast or even faster than we are here. Um, jobs. We have people moving here from all over the country and a lot of people say, so where are the jobs? Sure, we have your lawyers and doctors and major companies here like Simplot and Albertsons um, and the newer ones that are coming in like T-Sheets and Paylocity. So you have opportunities there. One thing you should keep in mind, a lot of people that are moving here are either coming here with a job that they can keep in their other state and then traveling out on a Monday and Friday or 
many times during the week or maybe they can work remotely and then we have a lot of retirees so all of the influx of people doesn't necessarily mean they're coming here with work um, or they are coming here with work and they don't need to have a job here and the lastly where to stay depending on what you're looking at and where you think you might want to live that would uh, make an easier decision as to where you want to stay but I would suggest staying in downtown Boise um, you can experience the flavor of Boise and its people and food and the goings-on you can access the green belt and the foothills very easily which are two reasons that a lot of people move here so I would check out any of the downtown hotels Boise is a very safe city so you don't have to worry about safety there and we have a lot of new hotels that are popping up left and right I think we had four or five in the last year so you shouldn't have a problem getting a place in downtown Boise I hope that is helpful uh, whatever questions you guys may have please feel free to email me Kerry k-e-r-r-i at 43re.com or you can always click on the link below my relocation website and the form goes the form you fill out goes directly to me so I'm happy to chat and help you decide if Boise might be the place for you hope you guys have a great day we'll chat with you sometime soon